concerns I have about people throwing combustibles uh, and explosives, anything electric into uh, recycling, is that they usually will end up combusting at some point over here and can cause a fire or can cause damage to our machines or someone that's working. Um, so some of the dangerous materials we have come in here are, for example, something like this we found this morning, which is a lithium battery. Um, this will ignite caused uh, by friction from one of the front end loader tires and can cause a fire almost immediately. Uh, some of the things we find usually on a daily basis would be stuff like cell phone batteries, anything that you plug into a wall, or, or leading up to something as hazardous as this, which is a road flare. Um, any spark with this or you know, handled the wrong way, it can cause a huge fire and be extremely dangerous to a facility like this. The worst case scenario for me in finding hazardous materials here is things such as propane tanks. I have pulled out large 10 gallon propane tanks from things that people recycle. And uh, if you know, run over or knocked, you know, come to pressure, it will explode and could possibly blow up a whole building. I'm very concerned about the safety of my team when it comes to receiving hazardous materials like that. We all just want to get home at the end of the day. Sometimes our job is already very dangerous. So having those extra cautions and precautions really make it easier for us to go home every day. So what I would say to residents, um, just take the extra time to look at what you're recycling. If you don't know where something goes, take a couple extra seconds to look it up because it could be the matter of life and death for somebody else.